healthy dessert. So what are we doing Yes, here? this is called chocolate toffee almond crunch. And this is chocolate. Say that chocolate three times really fast. <laughs> chocolate almond toffee crunch. It's from my book, Healthy Holidays. Uh -huh. And this is just a great vegan recipe with very few ingredients. So you can use saltines or you can use like other kind of crackers, whole grain crackers, which, you know, I, I often use. But yes, if, if but, but I wanted to show you, you could get the things simple. Okay. And, and we'll you're going to the put these all over. Site, so. Yes, 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 okay. of course. Okay, so, so just put the saltines over. like here. Just deal them out like cards. You know, make them lay That's organized and ladies. stuff like that. Okay. All right. Ask so in the meantime, curious. I'm going to put. Now I use Earth Balance margarine because this is like the best uh, non-dairy margarine, and it tastes very much like and butter. It's, earth and it's very good. Earth Balance is like my favorite. And you're, what you're going to do is heat up the um, the Earth Balance and add sucanat, which is from uh, it is from the sugarcane plant, but it hasn't been cooked in cow bones. And it's really cool. Formaldehyde. The molasses hasn't been taken out. It's very little it's processing. Really it's really good. By the way, and while we're doing this, tell me about your movie. Oh my Hitch gosh, for Hitch for the Holidays. It's with Joey Lawrence, who's fabulous, and Emily Hampshire. No, 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 don't put those in. Don't put those in. Uh, Emily Hampshire and the two of them don't want to be involved with anybody, but the parents are all pressuring them, and so they pretend that they're a couple during the holidays while the parents are like, oh, ooing and eyeing, and it's very funny, and hilarity ensues. It's so <laughs> great. It's hilarious. I love funny movies. Yes, and I, and I play um, Emily's mom, and I'm very, um, I'm from a very Jewish family. She's from a very Jewish you family. You like big families, and don't you? I do. Yeah. Did you yes. really think you could do a Thanksgiving show without Oh, Mom? you're right. <laughs> Are you? I told, I told her, I said, she remembers being on the show. How yeah. could you not be I here? know, I, I know. know. I, I, and you I got the secret this. recipe. you going to be here. I said, oh, I you're so good. All right, you guys have to help Notice me. Notice how my brother always shows up when there's food. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna put we're gonna put this. Oh, you got lipstick. I got lipstick. Oh, sorry, you can't wear that later. Okay, so we've got the. Make him cook. Yeah. What is this? You're gonna put this is called chocolate toffee almond crunch. And Donnie burns everything. So okay. So there, I want you to put this over here. Last night I was eating almonds. This is true story. Last night I broke a tooth on. Oh. And for an Osman, that's a serious problem. I want to see. No, he fixed it. Oh my God. Oh, he fixed it. Okay. We have a dentist in your house. Okay. Well, you have, we keep you have a salon in yours. Yes, that's true. Okay. <laughs> that's so, true. Okay, so you're going to throw this on okay, here pour now. this over Just here. Pour this over there. Throw this on. Throw this Don't on there. Don't me, baby. <laughs> baby. Just yeah. like you drizzling. Know, no, seriously, Donnie can't cook. I can't. Oh, that's okay. I burn water. No, He's so faster. cute, he doesn't have to. Right. A little faster. Oh, okay. Wait, you yeah. telling me how to produce a show, Marie? No, I'm huh? at it. Huh? Look, brother, huh? you have to do this. Okay, and voila, he's also a magician. Okay, so that's it. Oh, okay. Let's get rid of all that. All right, so let's say it's been let's say it's been cooked for set for seven minutes. Then what you're going to do is throw the almonds over it. And she goes with that throw word. You again. throw, sorry. Throw all the almonds over. Throw, 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 throw. Try to hit the plate. Now I know why he doesn't cook. Much. He doesn't cook. Okay. And then <laughs> Oh, I broke the tooth. <laughs> then throw the chocolate oh, on top. Oh, no, oh no, here we go. Uh oh. Right. Whoa. Whoa. When you're well, here, right. How about like this, Donnie? Hey, here you go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> hey, audience. <laughs> <laughs> and then so a then, lawsuit ensues. Okay, all right. And then show us the finished So part. then you put this back. After you do this, you put it in for uh, two minutes, and you get it all oh, soft. Baby. And then what you do is you spread, 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 and then throw it in the freezer with, like, wax paper. And then, voila, taste. after a little while. And, and this is all healthy, and this is all healthy. Mm -hmm. I mean, totally one vegan. One more time. What's There's the name? a lot of people. One more time. What's the name of the movie? One more time. If you did. Thanks for the holidays. Thanks for the holidays, but... This is oh. organic. Say it again. This is called Sucanat. It's all organic. It's from Costa Rica. It won't give. It's a lower glycemic index and horrible white sugar. Everybody in the audience is getting one. Yay! recipe, just go to our website, hallmarkchannel.com slash Marie, and remember to watch Mary Lou and Hitch for the Holidays, right here on Hallmark Channel, and you stay. I'm talking to I'm you. I'll be right back.
Welcome back. Now, Thanksgiving is a time for great food and family traditions. I asked my brother, well, he asked to stay for this one because it's another food segment. But we're going to show you today how you can add a few personal touches to your big holiday meal that will make all of your guests very thankful that they were can invited. I, can I say something? Would please? you please? Do you want me to introduce? I want you to. Please welcome the creator of Food Networks, the best thing I ever ate. Please welcome David Hoffman. And you Give love David. I love, I love this show. This show. Okay. As a matter of fact, David, I want to say the first thing. I would love to be on your show. Go we'll talk. Because I, uh, I can't excuse cook. Excuse me, <laughs> this show is called Marie. Hey, hey, I'm talking here. It's not Donnie and Marie. Oh, uh, we need no, to show, show our backdrop there because, see, it says Marie and then there's a turkey. Just oh, remember, that's how this show is defined today, Marie and turkey. Hey, 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 hey. Speaking of turkey. <laughs> What you got here? So tell us what we're doing here. On Thanksgiving, 44 million turkeys will be consumed. And if wow. you wait until New Year's, another 22 million. So if people are coming to your house, My you got to better run. <laughs> you got to do something with the turkey to make your turkey stand out. Okay. Well, so you know, he, he stands out great. Yeah, well, exactly. try this with him. You know the old trick that where you would take aluminum foil right. and put it on the wings of the turkey so they don't get burnt when you're cooking it? Right. Okay. Well, we're going to take the aluminum foil and we're going to cut out little squares like this and we're going to fix them to the turkey in the checkerboard pattern. Yeah, you could do it. This is artsy. Yeah. And the theory is that when you cook the turkey, the parts that are covered, now you want to kind of, well, I don't have, yeah, make it into they a get checkerboard. Hotter? The, 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 brown, the brown will be darker on the parts that are oh, uncovered. you could spell things. You could do that. You could do a family logo. You could do, you could do a design like the Marie logo. Or you could do Or you could put this. your face on the turkey. Oh, look how cute oh, that is. This is so, something a little, a little bit different to make the turkey pop. David, that's cool. Okay. And tattoos. Okay. Yeah. You make little tattoos. Well, that's, that's one way. At least they're a little less permanent. And they are edible. Oh, you know that show, uh, Fantasy Island? Remember Tattoo used to say, the plane, the plane. You could go, the, the turkey, turkey, the, the turkey. turkey. Uh, <laughs> I read your mind. <laughs> and believe me, it's a dull book. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, oh, like so it. now you said something it's, once before. The best part for a lot of people is not the turkey. It's actually the stuffing. The stuffing. And yeah. a stuffing recipe boils down to about five things. There's usually stock, like chicken stock. There's some sort of bread, cornbread or breadcrumbs or stale bread. There's celery, there's salt, there's onion, there's sage, there's thyme. Right. And that's really about it. And then you need to mix it up. Water chestnuts. It. Well, that's one possible. So I have three stuffings here that are variations. This is my favorite part of Thanksgiving. On dinner, traditional so. things, except they have a secret ingredient that will surprise you. In now, these? In all of these. Okay. Now, I promise you it's nothing like survivor weird. There's like no we're not eating, we're not eating bugs there. or anything else like that. <laughs> this is a typical meat type stuffing, like you would have a sausage stuffing. Yeah. That one has dried fruit, and this one has mushrooms can and I chestnuts. Sample it? I want you to sample well, it. Well, see, then I, I knew he figure, was here for this. I want you to see if you can figure out what's in it. What's in it? Wow. Well, it's good. I, I know what's in it. And I, stuffing. No, but do you taste, do you taste, you taste the onion, you taste... It doesn't taste like sausage, but it's got something like that in it. What is it? It's really good. White Castle oh. Spider. Oh. Now, the White Castle I people... I love White Castle. The White Castle people have, they created this recipe years ago as part of a contest. It's and it's good. really easy. You tear them up and it, and you know, it has the onions that have seeped in them. Yeah. So those are yeah, great. Yeah, yeah. You just want to make sure when you buy them, you don't get ones with the pickle. You don't want the pickles. So it'll kind of... Hold pickle, the pickles, yeah. hold the lettuce. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Okay. exactly. <laughs> Different burger chain, but I'm sure... Well, that would be... So you're going to put this recipe on our website, right? That'll be up there okay, on the website. Okay, so... I take, not, I I take, I'm, only, one, I'm only bringing these. I take no credit. That one's, about that one's got like dried fruit. It's got papaya. It's got pineapple. Apple. It's got. Uh, it looks like fruit. It does fruit. have pecans. That's really good. And you hit the nail on the head. It is, it is the. It is a fruit cake, fruit cake. from the Collins Street Bakery. Finally, of course, the kind of Texas. Now, now this is interesting. Finally, someone has come up with something to do with fruit cake that works. You know, because fruit cake is. Do you really want me to go there? No. <laughs> okay. Okay. Mushrooms, See, I set chestnuts. It up and she knocks it out. Mushrooms, <laughs> chestnuts. I still like White Castle. No, okay, you may be able to figure this out by what it looks what like. What is this? Mushrooms and chestnuts. And instead of cornbread... I think it's more, more um, Mexican tasting. Well, like that's Mexican because food. it is yeah, I always tortilla love, chips. Oh. I always love second. Now, this, like is this. Also, this is also great because it's gluten-free. Yeah. So if, you, if someone can't do the bread and all Wait that... Wait a minute, it has no bread in it, it's just There's the no chips. bread, just the Very chips. Very interesting. Fantastic. Okay. I, I think I like these two better. Okay, normally White you castle. plump your stuffing on your plate. So one thing you can do is you can make them in little cupcake tins, or you can get like a fancier tin. Oh, that's a great and then idea. Here, this is stuffing. And see, it's the, the little acorn. One? Yeah. Oh, cute. I love the uh -huh. audience. The, leaf. the audience is, oh. No, the yeah. Decker Lantern, they're saying we want, they're all hungry. <laughs> We're eating our, our faces off here. So, 
So, and oh, then, you know what? That's really good because I cook my turkey upside down. Oh, okay. And so and my you, stuffing can sometimes get, I, I cook half in an oven and half, half up, but uh, I could do it this yeah, way. Yeah, if you cook it out, it's, it's kind of a nice way to do it and sort of it's, it just adds to the presentation of the That's table. That's good. These are, are cupcakes with pumpkin pie filling inside of them. Kind oh, of way, I'm you know, all really? So if you can see, you can pick now, one up. We, yeah. have to have yeah. one. So wait a second. I want to I take I've this off. I've been eating them all morning. You've been, yeah. Wow. <laughs> but you say it's inside? Yeah. So can I break it open? Yeah. And there's the pie filling inside oh, the cake. That is so cool. Okay, now I have to taste it. See how cute. Well, it looks terrible. I kind of ruined it. <laughs> just but like it, you do everything else. Look, right? see, the, the filling is inside. Can you see that? It just says, you know, everybody's got their pumpkin pie, so you got to, you know, kick it off. Right, good. So happy holidays. <laughs> David, thank you so My much pleasure. for being here. My for pleasure. all the recipes, Thanks go to our me. website, hallmarkchannel.com slash Marie. We thank will be right back. I want to be on that You're track. staying. Oh my gosh, he's starting already. Sorry. Thanksgiving Sorry. is all about what's going on at the table. Food, family, conversation, giving thanks. And I'm really excited about the next guest. Now, uh, I, I wanted to bring my friends on the show that are very, very talented. She is my designing 911 call. <laughs> Literally, she helped me design my craft book. Really? And get this, 17 hours. Oh, come she on. said I gave her pneumonia. <laughs> anyway, I, <laughs> and she also helped me plan my wedding in two days. Wow. She's amazing, and she is here to show us how to turn your table into an elegant holiday presentation and do it for a fraction of the cost. Please welcome my girlfriend, designer Amundo Cheryl Burke. Hi, Cheryl. Nice to see you again. You know, yeah, Cheryl, don't even, don't even Cheryl. Like, okay. Every time I call Cheryl, it's like, hello, Cheryl. Hey. <laughs> True. So, Cheryl, tell us what we're doing here. We're, we're creating a beautiful table for uh, Thanksgiving and a fraction of the, of the cost, right? Exactly. You know my favorite saying, cheap and cheerful, okay? Right. We love to do things for <laughs> inexpensive. Kind of like Marie. No. <laughs> Classic. Will no. you get out of here? <laughs> I'm okay. gonna, can we exile him? Yeah, to the kids' table now. Go, to the Go. kids' table. Goodbye. Seriously. Draw your turkey. <laughs> draw your turkey. Okay. okay yeah, okay. go draw a turkey, turkey. That's right. Okay. <laughs> We're going to show some fun, simple ideas. This is really Simple cool solutions stuff. for a great, lovely Thanksgiving dinner. Mm -hmm. Okay. So first of all, we started, instead of linens, we use burlap. It's huge this year. You know that? Okay. Did you know that? This is so interesting. Burlap. Can you believe it for a table? And very cheap. Two ninety nine a yard. So we've done the, the runners out of the burlap, and that's our beginning. And look how cute to take it and, and a just little tie sprig. It the and all of a sudden you look like you have a fantastic tablecloth, and it costs you about five dollars. Oh, so so cheap. Yeah, so cheap. Mm -hmm. Yep, we love it. And a little sprig of bittersweet tied tied on is great. <laughs> Donnie, stop it, oh, dear. He's in trouble. He is in big trouble. Okay, and then Re, I like to splash on the color. on the table because this is cool stuff this okay is really Cheryl. Cool. okay so then we've layered with some color I love so we've got the orange placemat so look you take the burlap you have a little color here and then you add the color in here yes and we've got the, the great brown charger just the sim the cream just dishes which I love and then this splash of this rusty now, red what if you don't have matching plates what if you want to you know, do something like that these aren't matching plates this is all a mix and match and okay. that's what's really fun about it and I think it makes it more interesting okay so let's talk about the centerpiece okay Marie, because it's so simple this is a lantern that we purchased and then it's just filled with kind of the sparkly pumpkins and some acorns and different Isn't things cute? and it's really easy to do anybody can do it and the thing that's great about it is that for the holidays you could just change it for Christmas and put ornament balls and so, so it saves you a lot of money to have one piece yes. and change it out for holidays. And you could use that anywhere in your home and then just move it onto your table. And, and it's then, not the typical looking thing to right, the table. Right, right. And it, you can do it in advance. And then we've used a little unusual piece, a little candy dish for the roll, which is kind of fun. And then always candlelight, because I just think it warms people, it but warms your how heart. how cute that is. Yeah. You could do that with anything. And then yes, it, you it could. doesn't have to be matchy, matchy, perfect. No, perfect. it doesn't have to be matchy, matchy. That's what we love about it. Okay, okay very, should we very move cool. to the kids' table? Johnny. Right. What, what do I do? What do I do? So, 
What, what is he do? doing? Oh, this okay. is so cute, guys. Look at this. This is a great idea. T tell them what this okay, is. Okay, well, first let me tell you about this. The plate looks great, right? The right. price setting. Yeah. This is $1 plate from the dollar store. Oh, come on. Okay, let's show it, Marie. Come on. That's so great. So you don't have to worry about getting dropped or broken, okay? And then we've and got then they feel special. the same My setting. mom always did that. She always had the table for the little kids. It was always china and something right. nice. Right. Okay, and look at this. Donnie Ketch. Bean bag. Okay, That's how much? That's what you sent home with your guests, okay? How much? How much? How much? This whole thing. Oh, this right whole there. thing. Oh my gosh, this was probably, well, maybe five dollars at the oh, most. Oh come on. At the most, really, it was. So. But what's really cool about this, and I asked Cheryl, because Cheryl's the best at this. You can make this. It's very easy. Yes. It, it's easy to sew, and you can put stuff it with candy, with beans, with treats, and anything, and send it home with the kids. And we're going to give them that uh, pattern. Yes, we've got the patterns for those. So we'll show you how to make those, and they're so so easy. Thank you, Cheryl. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. It's great. It's so good to see you. Again. Yeah. We're going to make one of Cheryl's designs for these little pumpkin party favors for the kids. And where you can go to download the patterns so that you can make them at home, just go to our website, hallmarkchannel.com slash Marie, and we'll be right back. You can put this you can put rings in there and whistles. Oh. I love what you've done with the place, Marie. Yeah. Thanksgiving is all about gratitude. I'm so grateful you stopped by I, today. I'm, I'm, I'm so glad I did, too. And... <laughs> I happen to be in the neighborhood. And we decided to change it all, so we're going to do something a little fun. But before we do, before we're going to sing for you today. Yep. But before we do, um, one of the things that we were talking about is how, on the commercial, how thankful we are. Um, we were just saying, uh, my gosh, five decades now that we've been in this business. That's right. And we have uh, Las Vegas. We're Las Vegas. You know, we started uh, to, uh, to do our Las Vegas show. Was it ten shows? Or, or, no, it was six like, months. It was a six, six month, month. No, it's like two, two weeks, wasn't it? And no, then we got months. a six See, now month. Now you're getting an argument now. <laughs> but here we are going into our what is it, fifth year? I know, in Las Flamingo. Vegas. Yeah, there it is. And and it's so crazy because, you know, 2012, end of the world, we figured what the heck, here we are going out with a bang. <laughs> But, you know, here, here's the thing about show business, you guys. You never know what's going to stick and what, what's not going to. We, we put forth an enormous amount of effort in that show. And thanks to you, we're going into our fifth year in Vegas. And so we owe it to the fans. It's really down to the fans. And then, just so you know, we were just saying on Thanksgiving Day, actually, we always work on everybody else's holidays. We love to make people happy. On Thanksgiving Day, we're catering this huge meal, and we're rehearsing for our big holiday show. Yes. Uh, we're going out on our Christmas tour. We started two years ago in New York, then we did Chicago last right. year, and this year... Los Angeles at the Pantages. Pantages. That's going to be fun. We're going to Salt Lake, and, and then... Because, and because, then. but before that... But, but, but because we were known for our Donnie Marie Christmas shows. Yes, And yes. so it's become kind of an event. We're going to start at Arizona, Los Angeles. And Salt it's Lake. a fun show. Come see the show. It really is a blast. <laughs> Footage, all kinds of memories. But then it even gets any, even bigger than that. In January, we start over in, uh, in the U.K., in London, at the O2 Arena. And it's going, so it's going to be a huge arena tour over there. It's just uh, we're so grateful. For, for being able to be in the business this long and still going strong. We love you so, guys. We're so thank so, you. So thank you very much. Yeah, and then, so what we decided is we decided that uh, we would put together an album when we were in Las Vegas and the shows were being successful. Our first album together in 28 years. Yeah. I was one when I recorded it last Why time. Never? But But then, before we do this number, uh, which we found out that after 28 years of yeah. not recording together, the album that we did when we were at the Flamingo Hotel, uh, our current single went to number, number one, one, thanks to you. <laughs> now, before we do this, I have to have you show them Donnie's a grandpa. Yes. My, my, fourth, my fourth grandbaby was born not long ago, uh -huh. and uh, they sent me this picture. I got to show it. Can you oh, get a close-up Oh, shut up. up. He's so cute. Can you get a close-up of that? Like you, they are so blessed. <laughs> no, it's so fun. There's so many things to be thankful for this time of year, and uh, that's one of the things I'm really thankful for. Yeah. My grandkids. I'm and not. My kids, my I'm wife. not a grandma yet, but I live vicariously through the kids. Yeah. yeah. Hey, let's sing. Let's sing, let's shall sing. we? <laughs> I don't read the paper. 
I don't watch the news. I can look out my window. The sky is still blue. We're running on empty, but the glass is half full. It hasn't been easy, but we're doing okay. The bills keep on coming, somehow they're getting paid. I'm counting my blessings and putting my faith in you. apartment is fine I can sell my car baby I don't mind we'll weather the storm do what we gotta do Ooh, everything I need is inside these walls as long as we're together I have it all I can wake up every morning with this point of view information on today's show at hallmarkchannel.com slash Marie. And before I say goodbye, this Thanksgiving Day, I would just like to say how grateful I am to all of you for watching the show. Appreciate it so much. Thank you to... I, I want to thank all the production staff and all the crew here at Marie for making this all possible. They are fantastic. I couldn't do it without them. They're my extended family. And also, they're the best. I want to thank my guests, Mary Lou Henner, David Hoffman, Cheryl Burke, and of course, what's his name right here? Man. Donnie! Thank you for being oh, here. I, I had to surprise you, Marie. I had to come in and just uh, do a little surprise. Yeah, that's what I do all the time, you know? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going to come back again one of these days to surprise you. I hope I so. We love you. I'm so, I miss you. Although I do like getting top billing. I okay. I, I think we should do one more song for him. Let's sing us out. Let's do one it. One more from the Here new album. This is from the new album. Sometimes I lie awake, I think to myself What did I do to deserve you? I always used to say, fairy tales just fade away I never believed that they came true But then you came along, and that's when I knew Oh, there was nothing the two of us couldn't get Everything you never ever know what you 
mean to me You are a part of me You get right down to the heart of me You are a destiny I always give you the best of me 